Courtney Kaysen, and it's time for Jacqueline I, Susan Graver, with my gorgeous pal in crime, Jacqueline Graver. Thank you, Courtney. So you nice. look smoking today. Thank you. We will get to that jacket later, but I'm telling you, you look so New York, foxy, supermodel. Do you, of, do you walk the streets with that? You're going oh, out of course. Friends? I love it. I'm kind of channeling the ballet vibe today. Oh, I love I like it. Oh, it's so ballerina. <laughs> oh my gosh. I oh, what is that movie? I can't even think of it. It's the one where the, they do the Michael Jackson song in it. Center stage. That's love a great it. Movie. Oldie but a goodie. Now let's get to Girls Night Out because Christmas Eve's coming up, and then yes. most importantly, New Year's. And so you know, I feel like it's one of those things. This is an outfit that you can go to one of those really big parties, or you can go to a house party. It's it's everything this in between. This is a perfect perfect party outfit. Sure. Yeah. Now, where did you get your inspiration for okay. all this? I don't know. I really think I was just channeling the ballerina vibe this week. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where it came from. Have you been doing more plié? Charles <laughs> and Charles. Yeah. It came to me. So. I love it. Here I started with this basic liquid knit top, yeah. except it has the beautiful shoulder details. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to wear it without the vest, it sure. would look awesome also. I know, I love that because I feel like I see in all the magazines, they all have rhinestones I so on their shoulders. Right I love it. Yes. No, it's perfect. So this is awesome. I put over this great vest on top. And you know, I never see vests with skirts. I don't know if people are afraid to wear them that way, but even more so with myself, I feel like I can only wear vests with pants because I'm like, yeah. oh, it's so menswear. But you're not making it menswear. You've taken it with obviously no. a cute skirt of yours and made it very feminine. And I love, yeah, mixing trends like menswear with girly and yeah. feminine with like grungy. Yeah. I like putting all these different styles together. Sometimes I'm like so 90 miles an hour, like, oh, it has to be all menswear, like huge watch, <laughs> like huge shoulder pads. What? <laughs> Well, really quick, let me tell them what you've styled. The mannequin has on A209552, and it's the Susan Graver Liquid Knit Scoop Neck Top with embellishments in the dark grape. And then you did the Susan Graver Faux Leather Cascade Front Studded Vest in navy, and that's item number A203285. Now let's talk about you, Miss <laughs> Little Plie Ballerina. Yes, that's about all I can do. <laughs> I'm loving my outfit right now. It's so cute. Yeah, well, I first I have this great blazer. Sure. So, which I love. It has such a good shape and totally on trend with the menswear. Sure. And then let's say I wear this out to dinner, and then if I'm going dancing or something, <laughs> take off the jacket. They're ready for the night because I love this top. No, it's so cute. It's and I mean, it really, like, you have just combined, like, with this skirt, with that color. I mean, the colors just look fantastic yeah. on you. And you've paired it with something bold, like the black menswear jacket. I'm obsessed. Me too. And your leg warmers aren't bad either. And then some leg warmers. <laughs> Fancy. Now, if you're interested in what Jacqueline's wearing, she's got on the Chelsea Stretch Boyfriend Style Line Jacket, and that's item number A91758. She's also got that gorgeous 3-4 sleeve liquid knit scoop neck sparkle shirt in Dusty Rose, and that's A96. Four, four. Now, let's talk about your little accent ring. That has been a major player in our little... In almost every single video. But you know what? I think that's important because I was actually just talking to Michael O'Connor, who you know is a huge celebrity stylist, and he's like, you need to be an educated shopper. Realize what's going to make mm -hmm. a statement that's going to last, and don't buy something so that people true. are going to forget about. And that is the perfect example of a great cocktail ring. It goes with everything. Do you wear it with everything? Everything. I don't care what I'm wearing. <laughs> Jeans and a t-shirt or just or something more fancy. Sure. Well, okay. and you know, I love it that it has the stretch band because you can wear Perfect. it on any finger. Any finger you, yeah. I can't, because I can't tell you how many times that, like, you go to buy a cocktail ring, and it is an investment, but you can only wear it on uh -huh. one finger. And especially with all these, like, different neighborhood trends you're telling me <laughs> about New York City, it's important because if you want to wear it on your index finger, your ring finger, and you have that option. Yeah. And if you are interested in the Crystal Accent Signature Rose Ring in Gold Tone, it's item number J14. Five eight eight four, and then I've got another one of our another one. Pieces. It's just I I really like it because it goes with everything. It dresses everything up. Uh -huh. I could put this. I could take this off. Put on jeans. I'd be set. You'd be set. And this would be the centerpiece of my outfit, which is which is not a bad centerpiece. And that is J152709, and that's the Susan Graver simulated pearl and mixed bead messy style necklace. Paired with my ball in Susan Graver iced leather cuff watch with mother of pearl dial in blue, and that's J150117. 
Now, I'm really jealous, because you're taking off for the islands tomorrow. Uh, I can't wait. Now, are you going to wear that top that we showed last week as a yes, cover-up? Yes, as a cover-up. I'll take some pictures. <gasps> Please do. We'll have to show Definitely. them. We make all of our Facebook friends jealous that you went island hopping. <laughs> You'll have to have a really fun cocktail for me. Oh, I will, for sure. Okay, well, Merry Christmas. <laughs> you too. And Merry Christmas to all of you, and thank you so much for joining for us for another fabulous, wonderful Jacqueline I, Susan Graber.